everybody, Dave Basulto from Iographer. So you just got your new Iographer and you've been out shooting all day and it's time to come in and you want to turn it off. Well, you realize that the lock button is blocked and you're thinking, is this a design flaw? Actually, it's not. We purposely blocked it because we didn't want light to leak in and ruin the picture. So what do you do now? Well, we're very lucky that the iPad has a technology called Assistive Touch. Let's take a look how to use it. Okay, so here we are inside the iPad, and we're going to go into Settings. And inside Settings, we're just going to click General. In General, you're going to scroll down until you get to Accessibility. Under Accessibility, scroll down a little bit until you see Assistive Touch. All you need to do is turn that on by swiping it to the right. And that's it. Now get out of this. And you can see this little icon has come about now, and I can move it all over the place wherever you prefer. It doesn't lock anywhere, so you can put it anywhere. Now that's all I need. Now when I want to turn it off, I just press the icon and this comes up. And you can actually configure quite a few things with it and we'll do that in another tutorial. But for this one, we're just going to click on Device and Lock Screen and that turns it off. All you have to do is press the button once again to turn it back on like you would normally and there it is. And once again, Device and lock screen. So that's all you need to do to turn it off. We look forward to seeing some great stuff made with the iPad and the iographer. I'm Dave Basulto. Thanks for checking us out.